I'm Tom Whalen with Dee Dee from Frederick County Animal Control and Adoption. Good morning, Dee Dee. Good morning. Go to my Facebook page right now, cat lovers, or if you're a potential cat lover, and see the picture of this little purr machine sweetie we have on my Facebook page. That is Shayna. And what a sweet little... What a sweet little girl. Shayna was a stray? Yeah, she's really a great cat. She, Someone was caring and feeding for her, and they tried to find her owner and couldn't. So they brought her into the shelter, hoping that if someone was looking for her, they'd come by the shelter, because she's so good. She definitely was somebody's cat. She's a petite little two- or three-year-old brown tabby. We don't believe she's spayed. But one of the things that I should say when people hear our descriptions of pets that they might be looking for is that she could be one and a half, or she could be four. She seems young she to could me. Be, yes, she seems two or three to us. She could be spayed, and we can't tell. Uh-huh. Um, you could consider her a gray tabby, not a brown tabby. And we named her Shayna. So I guess what I'm trying to say is a lot of times people will say, well, that sounds like my neighbor's dog, but my neighbor's dog name isn't that. So people need to know yes. that it's a it's a rough idea of the animal that we have, and we really encourage people to come to the shelter in person and look for their lost dogs. Um, we won't have to worry about that with Dina because we all know her. We all know Sweet Pea. We'll know her when we yes. see her. Um, but for like a brown tabby cat, she if she's been lost for a month, someone could say, oh, well, my brown tabby cat's really fat. And then we say, well, this one's thin. No, you should come look because if she's been lost for three or four weeks, she could lose weight. So it's really important for people with lost pets to send us pictures and come in person. This is a really sweet girl. I got to hold her, and she just purred Mm -hmm. and bodied up. So she was a domesticated cat at one time, right? Yeah, she's someone's cat. She just can't find that family. Now, it also can be that someone had a cat that had kittens that they were very gentle and friendly with, and a kitten took off and was cared for by someone who then moved out of the area. So sometimes cats are loosely owned. And they're still affectionate and friendly. They just um, never were uh, completely claimed and given a microchip and identification so that we could reunite them with their owner if they get separated. You mentioned that someone was feeding Shana. Mm -hmm. And uh, if, if you feed a stray for 10 days, that cat's yours, right? Well, it is. The way we look at it at the shelter is if you come in and you've been feeding the cat for 10 days and couldn't find the owner, then we assume that we're not going to be able to find the owner. But what we do recommend if you're feeding a cat is call us and let us help you with uh, various charitable organizations get her spayed. Because by feeding a cat, you make her healthy enough to have kittens, but not healthy enough to raise those kittens and maintain herself outside. Uh, you know, and I would be the person to do this just because I think, ooh, the, the kitty's hungry. Yeah. Let's feed the cats. But you're actually defeating the purpose of what you all are really trying to achieve as far as right. population control. Right. And there's nothing wrong with helping out a stray cat. Just let us know you're doing it so that we can get you in touch with people who will help you spay neuter, help us get the cat. Uh, vaccinate those kinds of things at low cost so that they can, um, you know, they can make it. Shana is our Shockley Honda Pet of the Week. And if you're looking for a, if you're looking for, in my short experience, just a love and lap kitty that wants to yes, be by is. her people, call the shelter 301 600 1546. And if you were to adopt our Shockley Honda Pet of the Week, Crossroads Animal Referral and Emergency will help you get started with your new family member with a gift basket. With treats, toys, Mm -hmm. vitamin supplements, the work. She's adorable.